I hope he's at like, his local church just singing his ass away. Yeah. He deserves it. He and then the other video on his channel was so fucking scary. <laughs> horse yeah, it was a horse in that like destruction machine, like getting shredded. Like how, what I kind of, that. like one religious video and then like one, I don't understand what was going on, man. Make sure subscribe for all the different types of content. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I re-uploaded that horse video and my video got taken down after like 10 views. His video had like 600 views and it was still up. Wait, what was the horse video? Do you remember the video? He had two videos. It was the Tula Tula Sung Unsung. And then the other one was, uh, it was like, the, you know, Nepali Kopita. And then it was, the other one was a horse, like getting, sh oh, you know, those, you know, like those machines that like, they're like two cylinders and they like shred things. Like you uh -huh. put whatever in there. They, yeah, yeah, so yeah. they <laughs> dropped a horse. What the fuck? They dropped a horse in there. Horse. You don't remember that? No, I don't remember. I've never seen that video. No, dude, it took me like 30 seconds to realize what was going on. Like, yeah. Is that a horse? I thought it was just like a random like shit post. Like, Yo, I remember I took, I downloaded that video and then I posted it on. Um, Would you still have it? No, no, no. But I posted it on like the school uh, Snapchat story. You know, um, the Geo story for the Snapchat yeah, story. Yeah. And like, yeah. I'm gonna watch that. I posted the video on there. Dude, the Geo story for Pichu, which was insane, bro. It was the most obscene thing in the world. But yeah, I'm glad I added that contribution. Yeah, the horse getting like shredded. It was a dead horse. It was a dead horse. The horse wasn't alive, but it was really. Oh, that. Y'all remember? Y'all remember when we were in high school? Someone lit the C5 bathroom on fire. <laughs> yeah. Someone did it again. It was on TikTok. Someone did it again Except last week. On, at like, what? At Ridge? At, at Ridge? At Ridge? Yeah, the same shit. Someone lit the bathroom cell on fire when I was a sophomore. Someone did it again. Yeah, yeah. They did. I remember it was like they were smoking or something. I don't. I forgot what happened. No, they just lit the bathroom on fire, bro. What? Because, uh, <laughs> dude, like the, the toilet paper dispenser is like flammable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I thought. You see lights on fire. I thought the thing was like they were smoking and they tried to like put it out somehow, but it lit on fire or something like that. No, like, dude, they have a toilet, bro. That's like, the, like where would you put it out? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> bro, they're in a bathroom, bro. Dude, I remember one time, like, <laughs> like I would wake up for school, right, and like I would sleep like two hours, and I'd be like, you fuck, I can't put my contacts in right now. So I would do it like when I get off the bus before class started. And one day I went to the bathroom to put my contacts on. And like some dumbasses were smoking weed. Like, they were literally smoking a blunt in the bathroom before me. <laughs> and I went in and I'm like, oh, I smell like weed here. And then the fucking ROTC kid walks in, right? And he, 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 looks like a, he looks like a fucking school shooter. Everyone hated him. He walks in he's like, huh, kind of smells a little funky in here. What were you, were you smoking in here? I'm like, no, I'm put my contact lens in, dude. He's like, oh, what's your name? I'm like, you don't need my name, asshole. <laughs> and then, like, he leaves and he comes back. And, like, he's, like one of the assistant principals walks in. He's like, huh, were you in here smoking? I'm like, dude, I'm only trying to find my contacts, bro. <laughs> what kind of idiot do I look like smoking and still stay in the bathroom? What kind of fucking dumbass do I look like? Why would I still be here? <laughs> and then, yeah. Dude, in, uh, back in high school... Nara was a real one for this dude. This one thing I didn't even realize it until way later on. Like we would share earbuds in on the bus. Oh, yeah. We would share earbuds. So he'd give me one earbud, I'd have the other earbud in. And that's so romantic. Every, every time I know, right? Bro, we were gay, bro. Every time, uh, <laughs> every time, you know, uh, Big Gucci Sosa 300 or whatever that song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So it's only, on one, it's side. It's only one, side. one of the sides has Chief <laughs> Keef's part, and he'd always <laughs> give it to me. And I thought it was on both sides. And then, like a year later, I found out it was only on one side. And I'm like, man, he was really like just listening to the instrumental this whole time, bro. He was a stuff. real one. It's he, so real. he was such a real one for that, it's dude. So real, such a real bro. one. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'll use the ad libs. Wait, how did that pass, bro? That no one just like, makes it and just upload it? Like, yeah, that was so There's weird. No I don't understand why that happened. I think that was meant to be a thing. Yeah, they definitely was like, they were trying to do some like artistic thing. But I don't understand like why they chose to do that. That's like uncomfortable to listen to with two earbuds.
Yeah, dude, I got, but I got some good listening experiences from that, dude. That was really fun. And dude, that was some ride or die shit, bro. When I found out, I was like, man. I shed a tear. Oh my god. What the fuck happened to that guy, bro? Like, was, like, a pretty Emiliano, guy. Emiliano married his girlfriend when he was like 18, and his girlfriend was like 27. Emiliano, yeah, Emiliano got Emiliano yeah. by another Emiliano. He got Emiliano. It's basically like a three times the Emiliano situation. So basically, how Emiliano would do that, he date bitches like way younger than him. Like, some bitch way older than him dated him and then married him. Literally, like right after he graduated, he got married. I don't understand what he was doing. I don't. That's some like Furzing the radio type behavior. At least that was uh, 18. He didn't do some shit like that. That was like Sebastian's brother, right? That Wait what? Bad. Wait what, Faze? That was like Sebastian's brother, right? Like, I don't. I don't think so. Was he? What was his last name up for us? Or is it? Or guy was like Archer Rico or something? I don't remember. I Stop! I, I didn't mean to say. Dude, I haven't spoken to him since like apparently I found out. So he told me like that he broke up or like him and his wife got divorced. Of course, of course. That's like shit, like violence and shit. <laughs> it, it's like ridiculous, dude. They had a kid together hard. too. How much harder all these people? They're like, oh, let's get married. Dad. Dude, dude was a dad like at 19. I was so surprised. I mean, no, like, sure, Zoya, like, think there's about. Nothing wrong with that, but it's just like, holy no, shit. it's pretty. No, there is something wrong with that. There is something wrong with that. Absolutely retarded. Bro. I don't know, bro. Young boy, seven or eight babies or seven. Okay, dude. Young He's boy, young boy. He bro. makes like 10 million dollars a month, bro. It's different. Listen, young boy grew up in a household like that was absolute shit. This guy from suburban Sawani, bro. You're from Sawani. Mm. Not from Baton Rouge. Family too. His family was just fucked. Yeah, dude. He had, he had, like, like, it's retarded, bro. Yeah, no reason to be going out there and I'll get bitches up. Yo. Yeah, I don't blame, I don't blame young boys, bro. He was forced to sit, like, make music in his face. You know, and you know how, uh, yeah. Jaime yeah. liked, how Jaime liked that girl, one girl, Manuela? Yeah. yeah. I had one of my classes where on the right of me was Emiliano, on the left of me was Manuela. That's hilarious. <laughs> Manuel was on the left of me in one of my classes too. Like, <laughs> so funny as fuck, cause I would always send Jaime a picture and be like, "You're too." Yeah, funny. I did the same thing. <laughs> He's just pissed. Yo, like, dude, don't do that. Yo, Nair, what happened, dude? I haven't seen Shockers in forever. The candy. Oh yeah, them shits are gone. Say goodbye. I was so bombed too. That's the crazy. I was so hyped. I was so hyped to get them when I when I was going to Ridge, <laughs> but like that the first year I came to Ridge was the very year they took it out. God. And Nair would so bring it up. all the time, yeah. Now I would bring it back to this place, and it, I would get so hyped for it, dude. Yeah, I would always cop that shit from Ridge. Like, the only times I've ever eaten it were at Nair's house. And back in, like, Woodward so when I was a kid. Because we're talking about Ridge. Let's talk about something else. Let's keep Zob included. Let's be more inclusive. Dude, I, like, here's the thing, bro. I kind of wish I was in high school, but, like, y'all's high school is gross, bro. I don't know.